Hi Aquarius and welcome to my channel. This reading is your general reading for the month of August. This is for Aquarius Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Mercury. So Aquarius, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe and hit the notification button because I'm uploading a new video every day. So don't miss the video. If you are interested in personal reading with me, scroll down the screen, you will find all the information the prices and how to contact me. So this is for you, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Mercury. This is your general reading for the month of August. So let's start. Uh, this is who you are or the heart of the matter at the moment, Aquarius. And this is your health, your love, and emotion work career and finance family friends and support most possible outcome or what will happen or the future and your advice uh, this is your energy aquarius it is five of swords you are in time of a challenging at the moment uh, you could be challenge yourself or uh, others challenging you or you are in a challenge with others uh, but it's a time of winning as well. You are in a time of winning. Or at least you are planning to win. Okay, so just let me a second. I have a look on all the cards. Okay, so you are at the moment Aquarius, the hanged man reversed or upside down. So this is means that you are not waiting anymore. You, if you have been waiting for something, it's time now to take a decision, time to take a move. Uh, you decided as well to take a decision or take a move. Uh, for some of you, you could be rushed already to take that decision. Uh, maybe you know the one who decided to take the decision. You've been rushed to do it, but uh, you can have to do it anyway uh, and does look like it because your energy is the five of sword so you are in a challenge at the moment or someone is challenging you so you found out that it's time to take a move time to take a decision and just to finish it up but you are a winner in it uh, it's as well a, a, a transition state between you being waiting for something and with the decision of i have to finalize it and take a decision now so it's not time of waiting anymore it's time of moving time of being active uh, time of uh, jump and uh, take advantage as well uh, about your health it is three of wand so this is means that you are at the moment uh, in time of looking at the future uh, you're looking at your health from uh, a positive perspective uh, you're making a plan, a long time plan, actually, like you uh, thinking about what should you do uh, for yourself on the long run uh, can keep you healthy and uh, keep you uh, young as well, keep you active. Uh, you're holding on to uh, some choices and you're thinking about uh, which way should you go. Uh, you, For some of you as well, uh, you could be waiting for uh, a surgery or uh, waiting for uh, to hear from a surgeon or something like that uh, and uh, it's a bit of time of waiting you are in a queue uh, for waiting to a surgery or a checkup or something uh, but this is will be rewarded as well it's just time of waiting and you just need to be patient about it uh, you are looking as well in the future you are valuing your health at the moment and uh, thinking about the choices you have made and the choices you should take for the future so you keep yourself healthy and uh, you need to look as well at the future um, in a way different than you were looking at it before if you think that you not being taking after yourself or looking after yourself in the right way this is the time actually to make a long term plans and uh, changes which you can make a lifestyle it's not only about uh, because the three of wand is about uh, permanent and long term changes and mainly planning ahead for it is like five years uh, plan 
so this is means that not making it changes a fast changes which is uh, a quick fast and then or quick fix no this is looking at a long term fix so if you're planning to make a diet it is the time to look at your whole lifestyle to lose weight slowly on a long time but make it a habit make your eating is a habit of healthy eating if you uh, sick a little bit and you're going to the doctor and uh, you plan to make some changes for your blood pressure or any kind of uh, medical health uh, this is means that you need to make a whole life uh, style changes uh, being like for doing exercise uh, watching your food uh, checking your blood pressure or any other medical condition regular so this is to look at your health from the perspective of uh, long term changes uh, changing your lifestyle on uh, long term small changes which will bring outcome slowly but on the long run on the long term it is very successful and permanent uh, for your love and your emotion it is six of cups so this is mean uh, that you could be overwhelmed at the moment uh, with emotion from the past for some of you you could be with uh, stuck with some emotion uh, from the past this is, could be anyone because this is love and emotion so it can be any emotion could be uh, a lover it could be a friend uh, it could be any kind of emotion it could be your childhood memory as well uh, you could be thinking about your kids or you're missing your kids if your kids are not with you uh, for some of you uh, this is could be as well a reconciliation or a lover return so if you are waiting for a lover or expecting or you wishing for someone to come back they probably will come back soon uh, this is as well about uh, a playful time uh, a relationship memories uh, it's time of remembering more than uh, only enjoying it it's uh, time to enjoy but it's mainly time that you uh, have like nostalgia uh, overwhelming emotion you're thinking about the good times a good memory uh, and reconciliation for work career and finance uh, you got five of wands so uh, this is mean uh, that you have at the moment uh, the five of wands when it is upright it's about competition challenges but when it is uh, upside down means that you uh, no longer in a competition no, you're no longer in any disagreements uh, so thing is, is calm down at work in your career in your finance uh, it's uh, quite calm uh, your work environment if you did have any dispute uh, it will be solved this month uh, if you have any arguing or any competition when it comes to work or your finance uh, thing is will absolutely get better uh, and will be solved as well this is why uh, if you are in the five of swords you will win you will be the winner so it's time of winning actually it's time of quietness uh, time of achievements and getting your success the success you want so like is no one will be in your way uh, no one if there is any kind of a stubbornness if someone was in your way uh, stubborn in your way at work or uh, you planning to get a mortgage or signing a contract or anything like that and thing is was not moving that stubbornness will go away from your way and things will move actually uh, and now you will feel that the world uh, is more smooth and all the roads in front of you is easy so there's no more challenges this month things will get better is any dispute it's solved already uh, for family and friends support king of cups so this is means that you are at the moment trying to get your balance and you're trying to uh, balance your emotion with your heart as well uh, sorry with your mind uh, this is why because you are in a uh, time of taking decision or you've been rushed to take a decision this is could be if you are uh, regarding your kids or if you have uh, a beloved coming back, you probably will rush to take a decision about them. Or you will be at least uh, thinking about that. It's not going to be waiting anymore. I should do something about it. Uh, if you have a matter regarding your family or friends, uh, family can be as well husband or wife, uh, kids as well. 
uh, you will uh, actually have to take a decision. Uh, you can't leave the situation hanging anymore. That will be the time. So you need to step and take a decision about it and finalize the situation. Uh, King of Cups as well is about wisdom. So this month, you need to be wise. Uh, move slowly when it comes to taking a decision. You, you will take the decision, but you need to take it wisely. You need to balance your heart uh, with your mind. Uh, because this is if family or friend, usually we involve our hearts a lot. So if it is a decision, you need to involve your mind mainly. So think with your heart, but final decision is with your mind. Uh, you need to uh, get as well to a point of uh, your em like uh, sensation of your emotional maturity. Uh, be in contact with your inner self, with your inner guidance. Uh, time to get uh, more stability and you will be probably generous with uh, your family or your friends as well. Uh, they will need your support and uh, you will of course always as usual. Aquarius are very generous and they are healer as well. So you will use this time your healing ability to heal your uh, one of your family member or one of your friend who will seek your support. Uh, you will give someone an emotional security or uh, emotional uh, stability. Um, you will help someone uh, maybe this month to heal uh, or someone in your family or a friend might be in a crisis or uh, having something going on and you will seek your help. Uh, just uh, asking you as well to take right decisions for yourself and for others. Maybe this is could involve that you should take a decision as well. Uh, and this is telling you to uh, create a balanced atmosphere in your family and between you and your friends as well. Uh, because if there was any obstacle in front of you, I think it is smooth at the moment and you are more balanced as well. And to act from control the emotion, not from just your instinct. Okay. Uh, so the most possible outcome, the future, or what is the advice for you, Aquarius, this month? It is the King of Sword. So this is means that to focus mainly on your mind more than in your heart. This is why you need to be the King of Cups to balance your emotion uh, with your mind, with your rational mind. Uh, and you end up with actually detach your emotion completely and you will probably take your decision mainly head over heart. So uh, whatever the decision you are need to be take or need to be taken this month regarding work, health, finance, whatever it is, uh, it will be head over heart decision. And you will think mainly to detach your emotion and it's just for the sake of you, yourself and others. It doesn't mean that you won't be emotional, but just you will find out that it's the best way to go is to work out your mind and take the decision mainly with your mind, not with your heart, and you will detach your emotion from the whole situation because this is, will be for the best of everyone. So, uh, because this is, will give you the high principle uh, and you will be able to use your mind to solve the confusion or the conflict through thoughts because this is uh, mainly about the active energy or active memory and uh, ability to communicate the truth as well and use your knowledge. All right, so this is very good as well, Aquarius. It's, uh, you've been going through probably a kind of uh, dispute, uh, challenge, competition. It was a rough time before and looks like it's easing now. There's no be more competition. Uh, if there is any dispute or a challenge, things will get better. Uh, we'll give you some cards for uh, advice. Aquarius, uh, this is the Romance Angel. Deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Yeah, this is maybe why it's asking you to be the King of Swords at the end. And it's asking you as well to be the King of Cup. Balance your emotion. Whatsoever is, who is the person you are dealing with and whatever is, if it's at work and uh, this uh, five of, uh, of one, the upside down, it's easy, but still it's asking you as a generous, I love a return as well, just a case. Uh, 
whatever the decision you will take, you be careful because that's why it's asking you at the end, you have to detach your emotion and take your decision uh, head over heart for some of you because this is not for everyone, by the way. Uh, it's just for some of you, if you think that the person you are dealing with or the decision you have to make is about someone you think was not honest with you before, if it's a lover return be cheating or something, you just need to be careful because this is could be someone coming back or someone you're dealing with, a family or a friend, whoever. Uh, it could be wearing a mask and they might not need the support they're asking for. They might ask you for money and they don't need it or they might be tricky or come back for reconciliation and they're cheating, whatever it is. It's not for everyone, but just if you're dealing with someone you think you don't trust, you be careful and it will be the time that you have to take the decision only with your head and it's a head over heart decision. As I said, it's not for everyone. This card, not for everyone. I will give you one card more because this is a bit negative card. So, and it's, uh, it doesn't mean that everyone will meet uh, a deceptive person. So I will give you one more card. See, winning. So there is a big possibility as well for others who having a lover return, if you hear from them that this situation will involve marriage, okay? So this is why you need to balance your emotion and still it's good to think head over heart. Even uh, wedding and marriage, it's a life decision which is need to be taken by head as well. Uh, one more card for from Angel Answer. Within the next few months within the next few months. So whatever is the decision you're taking or something you are waiting for or uh, uh, something you wait for it to be solved, it will be solved, but it will happen or completely finalized and you will get absolutely what you want in the next few months. Last one from the Angel Prayer. Take time to breathe. Thank you, angels. I breathe with ease, knowing you are here. So take time to breathe. Yeah, I think it's time to breathe. You've been gone through a lot, I think. So all the best for you, Aquarius. It's time to relax now. Time to take the decision, but uh, time to relax is that the decision will be, you will do it in uh, a good perspective and you will have good intuition about it and the outcome will be great as well. So all the best for you, Aquarius. Uh, happy August, so I hope it be good for everyone. Uh, let me know in the comments, what do you think about this spread and if it does resonate with you. Uh, I'm reading all the comments and I'm enjoying it. Uh, let me know what you think about it. All the best for you and I should see you next time.